final rod in the carbon metal range is the C3 LD. LD again stands for low diameter, so this is the slimmest one in the range. It's a 13 foot rod and is designed to handle weight from 125 to 200 grams plus bait. The action of the rod produces a curve that looks like a letter C when under full compression. However, the tip recovery is quick and accelerates the lead and bait to effective distance where pure fishing time overrides the need to spend months perfecting advanced casting skills. The low diameter is deceptive and this little gem has plenty of guts to handle mixed conditions. It is light and well balanced for the angler that follows his instincts and not anchored to one venue. Just taking the butt cap off of the C3LD, you can see that this one will accommodate a two foot reducer and the reducer comes standard with the rod. Moving up, got the full length Japanese shrink wrap handle, very long handle. The Sentry movable reel seat, fully adjustable there you can see, and the adjustable EVA collars just push up nicely against the reel seat there to stop any sand getting in. Moving up to the end of the handle, we've got this lovely silver Texalium finish. And a little bit different this one, we've got some metallic blue under wrap on here with black whippings over the top and some matching blue trimmings at the end of the whippings. Japanese shrink rubber, either side of the joint, fairly standard on most of the rods. Blue trimmings again, and first ring, first K guide there on the tip section. We've got the metallic blue under wrap with the black whippings and the blue trim matching the butt section. Very, very dark blank this one. Black, very understated with matching whippings there all the way through. Two sections of 3M reflective tape, just to aid your night vision, and finished off with a Fuji anti-tangle tip ring. Here we have the C3LD, 13 foot long, again, nice and slim, rated 125 grams to 200 grams with beard. Nice rod, plenty of bite registration as well in the tip. Plenty of power in the butt section and a nice curve in the tip. Fully loaded up there now.